Hey guys, so today's Sunday and I gotta do some cleaning and laundry and just kind of pick up around the house. It's already like 12 o'clock. I don't know where my whole day went. I'm gonna go ahead and do this mask before I start cleaning and stuff like that. This is the Bosha mask. Um, it's the charcoal pore pudding. So it um, cleans out your pores and helps with like blemishes and stuff, but it also hydrates at the same time. And right now I kind of need both. So I'm gonna throw this on my skin and then I'm gonna tidy up a little bit. Alright, so now I'm gonna leave this on my skin for like 15 to 30 minutes. It says 15 to 20, but I always leave my mask on a little bit longer, especially if I'm like busy doing other things, which is what I usually do. I usually will like throw on a mask and then um, do other stuff around the house and I'll just sit around and wait for it. So I kind of lose track of time. So that's what I'm gonna do. What are you barking about, huh? Oh, look at you, you're all ready for fall. Are you all ready for fall? Look at how handsome you are. That's my good boy. So I accidentally left my mask on for like an hour, but I got busy cleaning and that's always what happens. So I'm gonna make some, um, some French bread with garlic and butter because that's what I'm craving. And then I think I'm gonna make like um, a berry salad, just like lettuce and raspberries and blackberries. That's really all I have, so. Got my toast ready. Gonna pop it in the oven. No food for you, cause you already ate. Yeah. Ooh, you just got smacked in the face. Can I do that to you? So I went ahead and threw on some makeup since I've been cleaning for a couple hours and I kind of wanted to take a break and just relax. I just did like my quick everyday makeup look because I don't want to do anything crazy. Yesterday I went and got my extensions moved up because they had grown out. It had been like seven pushing eight weeks and they were starting to turn and get like super annoying so I went and did that and plus they were super dry and I needed to get them uh, deep conditioned so I never really use this foundation anymore but I decided to use it today um, this is the Rainforest of the Sea and I mixed it with the Wet n Wild foundation because I really like this one but I don't really like it by itself I only like it when I mix it with other foundations but Honestly, I never use one foundation because I'm never really happy with one foundation. So I usually mix like two to four foundations together to get like my perfect color and like different consistencies depending if my skin is more dry, which that's what it typically is, is more dry. So anyways, my little break is over. I need to um, finish cleaning. It's almost three o'clock in the afternoon. Um... I still got to clean my vanity and sweep and mop and do the laundry and yeah, probably catch up with you guys later. I'm super tired today. It's Monday. My cat's over here. She's waiting for her cat treats. Yeah, I'm wearing the same thing I wore yesterday because I didn't go anywhere and it's like a sleep t-shirt. Look at this sweet baby. Let's get you some cat treats. Here, we keep them in here. Oh, what's in there? All right, you come over here. There you go. There you go, sweet girl. So I always give her treats in the morning. I have my beauty blender here so I can wash it. Um, now I'm gonna make my coffee. And then I'll get this little guy his treat, huh? That's what you're waiting for? Yeah, okay. Hold on, then. Let's start. Pop it in. And use this cup, and I'm like, I always check it for spiders because one time there was a spider in my coffee cup, and that wasn't fun. So, just a habit now. Time to go start to get ready. Got my coffee here. Oh, I got some clothes drying from yesterday. Because I didn't want to dry like dry these in the um, in the dryer, so they're gonna have to finish drying after I get ready to put them over here. 
I cleaned my vanity yesterday. Minus this. Cleaned it up. Looks a lot better. What should we give you today? Hmm. Some of these. These are oven baked dog treats. I have chicken and lamb. Get a couple of these. Is it? Lester doesn't know anything because he's a rescue, so he just can sit, and that's about it. Down. Bing, bing. No, that's a wrong one. Down. Bing, bing. Good boy. Good job. Okay. Give you. Uh oh. We dropped one. Where did it go? It was in the shoe. I found it. Okay. Sit. Big. Awesome. Speak. All right. And that's all you get. So it's like 6.10 right now. I've been up for probably like 30 minutes. Um, I went ahead and fed the dogs because I must have ate all their food in the middle of the night because the bowls were... My dog, once he eats all his food, he drags the bowls to the middle of the floor, so they were both there. So he must have ate both of the dog's food, and then their water was like really low. So I went ahead and filled that up too. Um, I heard him drinking it a lot last night, so must have been really thirsty. And then made my coffee, did my usual stuff, um, washed my face, and I only rinse my face with water in the morning because my skin's so dry that I never wash it with like anything harsh in the morning. I just rinse some water on it. Plus it kind of helps you to wake up. So I always do that and then I just do um, my eye cream and my serum and I just use like a lightweight moisturizing serum in the morning. I use my Clinique lotion and then um, I let that sink in just for a few seconds. It doesn't take that long. And then I go in with my Kiehl's oil and that takes a little bit longer to um, sink in. And then that's pretty much it. Then I go in with my primer and um, my foundation. And then I just do like my everyday makeup routine. Pretty much every day is the same. I don't try to switch it up too much in the morning because... Um, once I get to like playing with the makeup, then I'm usually there for a while. Yeah, so I probably should start getting ready. Um, it's Thursday now. I do want to put up my Christmas tree soon because it's like all Thanksgiving is next week and usually my tree would already be up. I know a lot of people wait until the day after Thanksgiving, but I like to put it up like the first week of November. I think last year I put it up like... November 1st probably because I just love Christmas and decorations and all the lights. It's so nice. But yeah, I'm kind of late this year for me on putting up my Christmas tree. So I think for sure like tomorrow or Saturday I'll probably um, put up all my Christmas stuff. I've been wanting to go to Home Goods because there's a few things that I wanted to get. I've been on the hunt for new pillows for several months just popping in there from time to time but I haven't found any that I'm looking for yet so I'm still on the hunt for those I just go every every now and then um, I usually like to pop over there like on my lunch so I don't spend like all day in there because otherwise I could like walk laps around the store over and over because there's just so much to look at if you've ever been to home goods then you know how that is man I'm so stuffy this morning I don't know if it's allergies or what I gotta go get ready the dogs are ready to play, so it's going to be kind of noisy. What's up, guys? So today is Saturday. It's around 3 in the afternoon. I just got done doing my makeup and getting dressed. I used the Carly Bible palette. I'm going to go run some errands. I need to go exchange something at Victoria's Secret. I also have all my Christmas stuff back there that I'm going to be putting up probably this evening. That's what I plan on doing. Um... After I come back and kind of relax and change and um, after dinner and stuff, I want to throw up the Christmas tree and put out some decorations since Thanksgiving is next week already. I can't believe it. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm going to go put on my shoes and figure out if this is what I'm going to wear. If I end up getting anything home goods later, then I'll probably show you guys what I got. I'm looking for specific things, so I'm going to try not to 
stray from, you know, what I'm going there to look for. And hopefully I have good luck. Hopefully I don't get sucked into all their cute Christmas stuff there with all the glitter and the lights. 